Alright guys, so um, woke up this morning, not too long ago, to a new trailer for the movie Valerian and the City of a Thousand Planets, which I was not expecting, even though I saw the sneak peek that dropped and I knew that the trailer was dropping, I just wasn't thinking about it. It was in the back of my mind to Justice League and then Spider-Man, so when I woke up and it dropped, I was excited. And I also woke up to a sneak peek at uh, the new trailer for War for the Planet of the Apes, which drops tomorrow, I think it said, so expect the review of that trailer tomorrow. Um, but so, Valerian and the City of a Thousand Planets. I saw the first trailer for this, and I was like, that movie looks visually incredible. Hopefully the story is cool enough to match the visuals. Because we didn't really get too much of a taste for the story. We just got, like, a good look at the visuals. This trailer offers a little bit more story. You still don't get the full story, but you get a little bit more story. And a lot more freaking visuals. Holy crap. This... The trailer alone. Like, I was just... The visuals are spectacular. I was trying to see everything, and it started to make my eyes hurt. I was just, like, pausing and looking at every little detail. And... This movie... If it ends up sucking, which I hope it doesn't, because I'm honestly pretty excited for this movie now, based off of this trailer. Um... This movie... I hope will be good but if this movie is not good at least I'm pretty sure people are gonna walk out praising the visuals but um yeah so we get a little more of the story it focuses around these agents agent Valerian and agent uh, Lorelai I think is her name I don't remember at the moment because I am still kind of tired but, um, it's Dane DeHaan and Cara Delevingne, who, um, hopefully is a better actress in this than she was in, uh, <coughs> Suicide Squad. Uh, sorry, sorry, I had something stuck in my throat. Um, no, but hopefully she's a better actress in this, because mm, everything I've seen her in, she hasn't been that great. So, I'm not really looking forward to her in this movie particularly, but, um, Dane DeHaan, I have been a fan of Dane DeHaan since I saw him in Chronicle, and I think every role he has done since that I've seen has been pretty good. I even liked him as Harry Osborn in The Amazing Spider-Man 2. I thought he was a pretty good Green Goblin, too. Um, but... Yeah, honestly, I'm super excited for this movie, um, but I just hope if we get one more trailer, it gives a little more story, because so far all we know is that there's the agents, and they're on this, they go to this planet, and the planet is like a thousand worlds all meshed together, because all these worlds and societies have come together and shared their stuff. And it's basically a melting pot of different species and cultures and societies. And then there's this group of people trying to destroy it, and the agents have to fight them or take care of them. So that's all we really know. And maybe that's all we should know, because it'll be nice to kind of walk into this movie blind, but... Um, I just hope if we get one more trailer, it does give us a tiny bit more story points and not just rely on selling us purely on the visual spectacle of the movie, even though I'm already sold purely on the visual spectacle of the movie. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm really excited. I thought this trailer was really good. I think this was a really solid trailer. It gave me chills in quite a few places, and I'm really excited to see the movie when it comes out on July. First, I think, a uh, week after War for the Planet of the Apes, which comes out a week after Spider-Man Homecoming, so it's kind of
kind of funny how yesterday we got the Spider-Man trailer, today we got Valerian, and tomorrow we're getting Apes, because those are like three big movies coming out in July. So, anyways, uh, if you guys have also seen the Valerian trailer, let me know what you thought about it in the comments. Thanks for watching this video, and uh, I'll talk to you guys in the next